salut à tous, on se retrouve aujourd'hui pour un nouvel épisode sur Chaos and Deponia. Alors la dernière fois, eh bien, on s'était retrouvé tout seul dans ce... dans ce bateau. Avec plein de bruit, bah oui, enfin bref. Euh, du coup, on va voir un petit peu s'il y a moyen de récupérer des choses euh, ici. I would love to claim that I don't rummage around in trash, but who am I kidding? After all, this is Deponia. Et puis Blah, après, on sortira. Climbing. Oh, that is disgusting. No, I've had it. I simply do not belong here. I wait. What's this? Hey, that's my old anchovy bait. It's still good. Ok, bon bah bon, ça y est, on a notre premier item dans l'inventaire, c'est génial. Radar, voyons voir. I can't leave here, not without goal. Ok, euh, bon bah a priori il n'y a rien d'autre qu'on peut faire. Vers le port. Ah, nothing beats a fresh breeze from the sea. The smell of freedom and adventure. Toxic chemicals. And Tony's mother? <laughs> Shh, you're scaring the fish. Uh, rotten fish. Close enough. But this native presents a welcome opportunity to make use of my cosmopolitan tactfulness and my linguistic skills. Me, Rufus, <laughs> where I find lab belong to Doc. Are you talking to me, ape man? We put maps up for people like you. Ah, you mean heroes passing through? I mean people we prefer not to talk to. Hey, just so you know it, I have an excellent sense of direction. I don't need your stinking maps. So what you looking at it for? I'm not looking. I'm just shooting it a contemptuous glance. Ok. Ce que je peux et après on va essayer de d'aller voir Doc. And what now? What do you think? I have to get to Doc. Not a chance. I can't let anyone pass. Oh, you can let me. I'm accredited. You don't mean accredited do you i would know about that i don't care what you know or don't know i'm not gonna let some wind up flea circus get in my way and i'm certainly not gonna let you correct me no way far be it from me to correct you sir unless of course you consider a bit new calf a correction huh what do you mean oh okay i'll put this so that even you understand it <laughs> oh, why didn't you say so? Mais les méchants le chien. Neutraliser clever bite. Ok ou clever bite je sais pas. Enfin toujours euh, est-il que ce chien a priori que moi je j'ai Yuki Lobby. Euh, il faut le neutraliser. What a cute little doggy you are. I beg your pardon. My name is Cleverbite. I'm an autonomous, cybernetically highly developed service unit, programmed to perform complex security tasks. Cleverbite. Wow. Oh, such an amusing name for a robo dog. I will not suffer such indignities. Through the neuronal connection of computer circuits with organic cerebral matter, I am capable of processing more than 3,000 floating point operations. Per second. Can you sit up and beg? Perhaps not. But I could sit up and grab something until you beg me to let go. You know, you've got quite an attitude for a cyber whatever mongrel, but I'm pretty sure that your bark is worse than your bite. Do you hear me barking then? Uh, I don't know. All I can hear is... <laughs> 
I'll ask Doc to make you a cyber muzzle. To do that, you would need to get past me, right? <laughs> I'm not going to allow some stupid mutt to block my path. Actually, I'm a superior cybernetic. Me, 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 superior. Me, 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 me. <laughs> Let me show you who is superior here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Down. I am not sure I have comprehended your intention. That's because you're only a silly dog. It might help if you could talk in complete sentences. Down, boy. Bravo. With a little more effort, you might indeed be capable of forming an entire sentence. Ha, piece of cake. <laughs> Il se paie ma tête totalement. I hereby demand that you perform the act of down <laughs> good boy but i'm still not sure what you're really trying to tell me <laughs> well down down see <laughs> like this <laughs> this guy cracks me up c'est plus assis que couché stupid mutt what You're giving up already. How disappointing. C'est pas tellement que je souhaite abandonner, mais on a un bâton, un chien, ça va chercher des hey, bâtons. Look what I've got. And now, be a good dog and fetch the stick. What's wrong? Fetch the stick, or are you too stupid? Yes, exactly. That's it. Fetch that stick. Hmm. No. You go fetch that stick now. Atta boy. If you're so fond of that stick, why don't you go get it yourself? And if you're a good boy, I might even let you pass. Mm. Go on. I just threw a stick and you are a dog. So, what do dogs do in a case like this? I wait for you to make an even bigger fool of yourself? No, wrong. You fetch the stick. Or are you too stupid? Wait, wait. I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> C'est bizarre, ça a allumé la lampe. You didn't really just do that, did you? <laughs> I can't take it anymore. Alors, ce chien est un chien électrique. Et euh, quand on lui donne un bâton, il veut bien le lécher, le renifler, mais veut pas aller le chercher. Or, je sais pas si c'est lié, mais quand il s'est mis à rire euh, par la suite, c'est allumé la lampe. Donc, techniquement, si je joue au baseball avec l'ampoule. Exactly. That barking trash can may think he can shock me, but I'll show him what a shock. What? Well, I'm when when the shock. I mean, what what the what the shock? Oh, whatever. Some ingenious pun with shock. <laughs> shock <laughs> because of the electric shock and, and and so on. Oh, come on, Rufus. You don't need a punchline to be oh, brilliant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Et il se moque encore. Bon, bref. J'ai joué au baseball avec la lampe, le bâton, et maintenant avec un petit peu de Shatterton pour isoler. Yeah, le Shatterton, c'est du scotch utilisé pour isoler, du coup. Ok, ça, ça ressemble un peu à une matraque, là, quand même. Tu es un petit chien. Lèche ça. <rire> Now he's in for a nasty shock. Bah, tu lèches plus. Hey, what's wrong? Are you giving up? Yes. You were right. This stick business is just too much for me. You stupid muddy cur. Here, like this. You put the stick in your mouth. <laughs> oh boy, I can't take it anymore. <laughs> oh, 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 oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, 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 oh boy. Euh, il a implosé. Ah ben bah, voilà, neutraliser Clever Beat, ça c'est fait. Et ben bah, on va aller voir Doc du coup.
Puisqu'on est tranquille maintenant pour passer. Waouh. Plein de choses ici. Does it have juice? What is going on out there? Stop ah. playing around with it. Doc est pas loin. I'm in. Not necessary. I've got all the time I need. OK. Hey Doc, Rufus. At last, goal really almost bought it this time. But as I can see, you have everything under control. I'll uh, go look for Bozo then. He mentioned a cavern. Her implant has been badly damaged. I need to operate right away. There is only one problem. The data cartridge is not going to survive the procedure. I take it that's a bad thing? Well, yes. Her entire mind is stored on the thing. Her memory, her character, the ascension codes. I can save the data, but I need a bunch of empty cartridges. And these cartridges are hard to obtain? Mm, not really. This is the floating black market after all. There's nothing you can't get here. And brain implants are currently all the rage. I installed another one just the other day. You will find the cartridges in the gadget shop. What? Why me? Because I need to get ready for the surgery. And I need to familiarize myself with the local circumstances. Bozo said something about a <laughs> tavern. Rufus. All right, all right. So I get those cartridges in the gadget shop? It's right by the harbor, outside the city gate. Just have them charged to my account. But make very sure that you get the good cartridges. The cheap ones are bound to cause problems. Well, it's your money. Okay. <coughs> Chew first. That was a reminder that you are not to poke around in my things. Okay, good reminder good. heard oh, and ignored. Rufus, it's okay. Oh, ça va, ça va. Et si je prends ça? Ah bah là, il dit rien. Ok. Bon bah euh, on a des glaçons, c'est génial. Donc il veut qu'on aille euh, dans une boutique de gadgets qui se trouve à l'entrée de la ville. Donc on va sortir. Là on a une carte, c'est parfait. Hey you. Who? Me? No. We're talking to the three-headed platypus behind you. We've been watching you. We know what you're planning. Oh yeah? Seems like you know more than I do. You spreads fast in the floating black market. You've got something very valuable there. It mustn't fall into the wrong hands. And your hands would be the right ones? Let's just say we're friends. We're the good guys. And we fight the things depression by the Organon. Death to the Organon. The Organon is planning something. Something unspeakable. So unspeakable that we cannot talk about it. We've got to go. We've already said too much. But we'll be back. And then we'll get what is rightfully ours. Do not talk about this to anybody. So keep your back to the wall. And do not forget who your true friends are. Death to the Organon. What was that all about? Bon, la carte. Donc, on a dit l'entrée de la ville. And who have we here? Well, if it isn't the newcomer that everyone's talking about. They're talking about me. High time, too. All those stories of my heroic deeds are actually quite understated. We're not interested in fairy tales. You've got something that we want. Huh. Tough. Good looks is something you're born with. We are talking about the secret ascension codes. The ascension codes? Over my dead body. Uh, wait. Let me rephrase that. <laughs> Uh-oh. Il aurait dû mieux pour ces mots. Ow! Ow! Ouch! Ow! Ow! Ouch! Oh! Ow! Ow! Oof! Ow! Oh! 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 He hasn't got the money. I guess he isn't as stupid as he looks. So what do we do now? We'd better report this to Donna. Mm. 
pauvre Rufus. Oh. Oh. Lots of friendly people here. Oh. Maybe I should tone it down a bit. Ouais, hein. Euh, bah ça doit être ça, la boutique de gadgets. Espérons qu'il n'y en aura pas d'autres, là, ici. Welcome to Gilligan's Gadget Garden. You are being served by Shopomat 2000. How may I help you? Uh, yeah, Doc sent me to get a set of cartridges. Of course, we currently offer two different brands. The first is Platinum Proof Professional. They are somewhat more expensive, but of better quality. There is a cheaper kind as well. Cowboy Dodo's Jolly All-Purpose Cartridges. Their quality may not be top of the line, <laughs> but they come with a free colorful lollipop. A lollipop? So which brand do you prefer? Um... <laughs> and those are really the good cartridges? Of course. Remember, Gold's mind is at stake here. All right. Here goes nothing. Mmm. Ça n'a pas l'air sympa, ça. Did it work? I'm not sure. Something's not right. Mm, Rufus? Uh, I might have known. Why does the same question pop up in my mind every time I set eyes on you? Who's that good-looking guy in the snappy overcoat? Where am I? <laughs> because the aura of my magnetism is befuddling your sense of orientation. <laughs> Seriously, where did you drag me off to this time? And what is that awful smell? This is the floating black market. You're safe here. Safe? Rufus, I was on my way to Elysium. Well, yes, you were, but with the wrong guy. Cletus wanted to help me. And you trust that lying slime bag? Yes. Who I am more likely to trust? My fiancé or his cheap imitation? Hey! What's up with you? What's up? I wake up only to find myself in some stinking torture chamber. That's what's up with me. I'm already itching all over just because I'm forced to breathe this foul, polluted air. I'm about to be sick. I need to get out of here. Wow. She seems to be pretty mad. Not really. I just have a certain effect on explosive women. What? Lighting the fuse? <laughs> yeah, very funny. But she actually did seem a little volatile. Are you sure you didn't mess her up somehow? Hmm. I think I might be able to explain this. Some information wasn't written to the cartridge. Almost as if we'd used the cheap ones. Not as cheap as your excuses. Her mind appears to have been split three ways. So, the woman who just stomped out of the lab is only a part of gold? And not the most agreeable part, I hope. Come on, Doc. I thought you were an expert. It is nothing that I can't fix. But for that, I need all three cartridges, including the one that is currently inserted in her implant. Also, I cannot operate without the consent of the patient. Therefore, all three parts of gold must cooperate before I can go ahead with the surgery. Oh yeah, judging from her mood, she'll be positively enthusiastic about you flipping open her skull again. Hmm, agreed. Maybe you had better start with a different part of her character. Huh? Take the two cartridges that are still in the output hopper. And this thing. What is it? A remote control? Not quite. See that compartment in the back? Just insert one of the other cartridges and press the button when you're close to gold. That's what I said, a remote. It's more complicated than that. Data's written to a buffer and... And I can zap back and forth between two characters. No. Yes. Something like that, but just like a remote. <sighs> just <laughs> like a remote. Cool. 
I wish I'd had one of these for Tony. Hurry up, Rufus. The longer yeah, yeah, yeah. the fragments of her character get used to their independence, the more difficult it will become to talk them into having that surgery done. Go find gold and persuade her. All three parts of her. I will prepare everything else here in the meantime. All right, here we go. Ok, c'est parti. Alors, on sort. Gaul, où est-ce qu'elle est partie euh, cartouche, télécommande, bah déjà on va les mettre ensemble. The cartridge fits. Now the remote just has to work. Thanks to my charm, the rest will be child play. Ok. Euh, du coup. Ouais, enfin là, ça va pas trop nous aider. Et ben, on va se balader. On va passer par là. Ok, euh, allons voir la pharmacie. Non mais pourquoi tu t'en vas Ah ok. Bonjour. What? Where? So, what do you sell here? What does it look like? Well, no, seriously, what does it look like? I'm blind, you know. I see mostly mind-altering substances, illegal drugs, and questionable medications. Oh, good. That's all right then. This is my drugstore, apparently. How may I help you? Uh... You're blind? How come? Let's put it like this. I should have read the directions for use while I still could. Wait a minute. What is that? Uh-huh. <laughs> Are there any sites you would recommend? Very funny. I'm blind. Just in case you hadn't noticed. Hey, nobody's perfect. Nobody but me. Not if I see you first. Expired tranquilizers. <laughs> Better than nothing. Okay, pourquoi pas. Bon, d'accord, on a des tuyaux, c'est bien. Euh, télé dog, bah du coup non. Pharmacie, non. Là, qu'est-ce qu'on a Euh, ben... Là Et ben la voilà, notre goal J'avais un poisson qui ressemblait à ça quand j'étais plus jeune. Mais c'était pas un espadon. Alors. Super, donc lui c'est un de nos agresseurs. Là on a Bozo avec du sucre. Pioup. Une bougie. Hey, leave the candle alone. It's the only thing that provides light in here when the generator goes on the fritz. Ok. Et Ghoul. All right, Rufus. This is a routine situation for a ladies' man like yourself. Easy peasy. No reason at all to be nervous. You are eloquent and witty. Very handsome. And your hair smells of salt. Now, for the right facial expression. Uh. Here it comes. <laughs> Check. Charm cannons at full blast. <laughs> And now to come up with the best possible line. A classic. Take a deep breath. And then. <sighs> Here I go. Hmm? Oh, heavens, it's you again. You never give up, do you? Hmm. You have to come with me and see Doc. What for? So you can demolish my head even further. Ah, really turned your head, did I? Turning heads and demolishing them are two different things. 
With <laughs> Tony's tortoise, they weren't. Listen, Rufus, I am dirty. My hair is a mess, and my head feels like someone sliced through my skull with a circular saw. Yes, but there's no proof. And to top it all off, I'm starving. So, you had better stay away from me. Hey, if you're hungry, I've got a leftover bowl of peanuts from our last mud cake fest. Oh, yuck! It's growing hair! I bet this little bowl contains more killer bacteria than a biological warfare lab. Nah, we're all out of killer bacteria. These are influenza viruses. Bon, oui, is that on a gagné promise? un bol de cacahuètes. Good. That increases the chances that you'll stay away. <rire> What a woman. Et il commence à y avoir un peu de bruit chez moi, je sais pas si vous l'entendez au micro. En plus, on est déjà à 25 minutes d'épisode, donc on va se laisser là. On se retrouve la semaine prochaine en compagnie de Rufus, de Gaul, de Bozo, Nod, Gulliver, Garlef et, euh, et un poisson rasoir. Donc j'espère que vous avez apprécié cet épisode, que vous appréciez finalement ce Chaos and Deponia, qui est la saison 2, on peut le dire, de Deponia. Encore une fois, je vous dis à la semaine prochaine. Ciao, bye bye You're being pathetic, again about accurate bacteria in the fridge. It's getting boring, but packing bags due to the tea socks I threw to. Clam shakes rim, order some anodons gone. Didn't I explicate it? Are you still not persuaded? The stress growing on your time, panic membrane. Remember to pull yourself, sacrifice in the oh gosh, not to start all over again. To start all over again.